today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be installing a gearbox on the jet ski trailer. There'll actually be two of these uh, at some point, but uh, to avoid boring you to death in the installation process, we're just going to show you how we install this, uh, this one box. There is always the right way to do something, and then there's our way of doing something. So uh, problem solving, that's what we're about to do today. What you may see here are some unique solutions to challenging problems though. The key to this is it's already positioned, we're going to be under there monkeying around with it, uh, so we want to make sure that we don't bump it out of alignment because that's going to throw it off whenever we punch the holes through it. Now this bar goes through here, we still want to stay in the low spot because that's going to give us the better chance to, to grab those bolts as they come through. Using the old adage that my grandfather taught me years ago, measure twice, cut once, it's easier to take material away than put material back. What we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we're sitting at about an inch and a half in the gap here. No, an inch and a half here. The back is at about three and a half. Now, how far back do we want to go? Are we clear of the handle? Okay, inch and a half. And that's a well calibrated eyeball that's doing that. So. Uh, you get those checked up every once in a while. Is if the tape stays still, then that will go through there, that will go through there and there. I need to do more yoga. Let's flip this box. All right, straight up. Yep, straight up and over, just like that. And now we just kind of press that tape and make sure it doesn't run on us. All right. Now for power tools. Wrong way, Greg. You got it in crook there. Need a little bit more. All right, because this is our biggest drill bit. Again, the right solution is get the right size drill bit. Our solution is take the biggest drill bit you have and just kind of swirl it around a little bit, make the hole bigger. Just to check it one more time, that's about two inches. I like it. Um, the lid, this being a brand new box, this cable here is kind of forcing this box to close on us. So what we did was to keep it open, we just run a strip of uh, duct tape, or we'll take the roll and tape a piece of it uh, to the top. The weight counterbalances the, uh, the lid and we'll keep that lid open. Uh, save a big wind or a big bump or anything like that. Um, these are just kind of little redneck solutions to uh, big city problems. Just go right, right about there. Toolkit here. So what I need to do is I need to find my half inch. All right, so th that there and that there. All right, how much space do you got? Can you get a nut on that? Yeah. You can. Sweet! <laughs> Bump this box forward like that. Hocus presto, Bob's your uncle. All right, righty tighty, lefty loosey. Righty, as I'm saying it, I'm not even paying attention to what I'm doing. Yeah, I've, gotta, I've actually gotta do that. Okay, so that's tight. All right, give three or four to this guy, put three or four on this guy. That's, that's really solid. That's really solid. Now, the one thing, so you can see that corner is a little loose here, You're gonna bolt that down but when we, um, when we get that second box in here, come up through one box around this center post and go in through the other box. That is the installation of a gearbox on a tandem jet ski trailer. Um, thank you fans of Take Point Now. Tune in next week when Mighty Mouse will tell you, same bat time, same bat channel, I don't know what I'm doing now. <laughs> uh.